Hi guys, today I want to introduce you to a new house, LM Perfumes, made by Laurent Mazzone. He is originally from Italy, he is a fashion designer. He opened his first store in Grenoble. He always had a love for perfumes and he makes some outspoken perfumes. And I tested three perfumes of this house and uh, I want to tell you a little bit about it. They are designed, I think, by Jérôme Epinet. He is, a, he, he is somebody who also worked for uh, Atelier Cologne, I think, and some other houses, and he knows what he's making. And I think I tried three amazing perfumes that I want to tell you about. They have some special things that are a, li a little bit different from other perfumes. First of all, I start with the most impressive one to me, and that is the, the hard leather Hard Leather is a fragrance from this LM house. Here is the sample that is really, really, really animalic. It opens uh, with a beautiful rum, honey, but at the same time I smell castorium and civet. I smell a really animalic thing here. And I also smell rose. There's no rose, there's no castorium, there's no civet in this. It seems to be the Irish and the honey and the rum. And maybe the sterax that, that gives this vibe. But I smell some animalic beautiful thing. You know. ah. And there is cedar and sandalwood and sterax and agarwood in this. It's, the rum smells on this. I smell a lot of rums in the Caribbean. and. It, it reminds me of a very beautiful rum I bought in Nicaragua. And uh, it's old, really old, beautiful rum in this one. Very deep, dark. This is a male fragrance. Uh, it's a little bit like the, it has a little bit this Nasomato vibe, you know. Hard Leather by LM Perfumes. Worth trying. Okay, that's the first one. Then I go from the male all the way to a female, a lady's scent, and that is Sensual Orchid, ladies and gentlemen. I have it here, Sensual Orchid. Ooh, I put it on here. Ooh, and this is, yeah, something that it has almonds, it has mandarin, it has heliotrope, it has jasmine, it has vanilla. It is a sweet thing but in a silky way. I mean, it's a flower, but with a thick skin. It's like a water lily that you smell. It reminds me of the Garden of Good and Evil of uh, by Killian, or uh, La Belle Hélène from Bertrand de Javoux. Very sensual, very yeah, feminine. It has this orchid also, that's like the water lily orchid, Far, it's the far east atmosphere. It is like this: you, you, you can hear the water, you know, and at the same time you smell the sweet, toxic, silky, white-skinned flower. That's all in this fragrance. It is really a far east liquor-like, marshmallow, sensual, sweet smell. That's what I think about this sensual orchid. Okay, and the last one that is um, Black Oud. Here it is the sample. Now let me first put it on. Black Oud. Here it is. This is a very friendly Oud. It reminds me a little bit on uh, Esteban Oud. It's a floral citric Oud. It gets a little bit more woody later. It's a subtle romantic Oud scent. It has cumin and nutmeg in the opening, it has labdanum, and it has civet and castorium, what I smelled in the first one. It has incense. Most ouds are kind of really strong, but this oud is very subtle. So if you want an oud to put onto your work, and you want it to be very soft, but very beautiful and quality stuff, then this one is really for you. It is black wood, but in a very sophisticated way. So, that's what I wanted to tell you about this LM perfumes. I think they're all worth trying. They're very outspoken, but very sensitive at the same time. And uh, I'll see you next time.